Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. I am here to film another plan with me. This week I'm using the Pretty Plans kit. This is a gorgeous kit, one of my favorites I've ever designed. Right now I'm just running through the kit and showing you all the different sheets of it. It is a full, full kit. I think it has like 9 or 10 pages. So I took out my daily inserts and those are the ones I used to reference all of my activities for the week. I'm zooming y'all in and I'm going to start with the sidebar. And basically, I am just looking over again my kind of weekly overview for the previous week. Because as always, I always back plan in my weeklies and I always pre plan in my dailies. So again, I'm just going over the sidebar here. I am running a bit behind um, with my plan with me's, but I am getting them done. I actually just filmed a plan with me for. At this point, it would be this past week. So this plan is actually two weeks old. So yeah, but I'm getting caught up. So no worries. So I chose to put down the big plans full box there and I'm going to do a piece of washi under it. And so yeah, my son's out of school right now and I've been able to get a lot of work done in the shop. But that also means that there's a lot less time yeah. for filming videos and that my kids are constantly around when I'm doing it because we're on a slightly different schedule. And I hope y'all can't hear my son in the background, but it's my youngest son and he's a busybody. And I feel like he knows when I'm trying to do something and he just, he's pretty much a hater. <laughs> so I'm just speeding through right now, putting the date covers on. And um, I just basically am doing the little next week. So that's kind of like my sidebar for the next week. Sidebar kept pretty simple. Those are the dates. I, I kept the sidebar pretty simple in the sense of I just did a habit tracker to do list, putting down the glitter headers at this point. And, you know, again, like this spam of me is a voiceover, so it's a little sped up, but there are certain parts of it, like the date dots, the date covers, and the glitter headers that I sped up even more because they just take up more time. And, I mean, they're, it's pretty straightforward. <laughs> so, yeah. Um, so next you'll see me jumping back into getting started with the week and honestly y'all I will have to go back and fill this plan with me in so I really don't remember uh, what was happening this week um, because this is at this point two weeks ago but um, if you want to see it all filled in you can definitely I'll pretty much I did for April I did an April in review I'll do a May in review where I'll flip through and show all of my spreads filled in because I'm not going to promise that I'll even put on Instagram because a lot of times I'll post it before the pin on Instagram and then I'll never go back and post the filled in version so um in part because I don't have the best handwriting and so I just feel like the before the pins look better so I put down that really pretty full box with the washi stack and then I just put a fancy label there and like I said I honestly don't remember my plans for that week so I'm super sorry so I try to find something else to talk about um this plan of me from I'm looking at it in editing and it's pretty short so thank goodness I actually dreaded planning um, I actually dreaded editing this plan for me because it was such a hot mess I, I feel that way when I plan all of them to tell the truth but um I felt it was such a hot mess. I was definitely on the struggle bus. You'll see me lift up, even though it's sped up, you'll see me lift up the stickers a lot and put them back down. Um, yeah, I think like it was just a lot going on in the house, but I really want to plan. I really want to plan and get this plan with me up. And so, yeah. So on the next, so on Tuesday, I put down that really pretty kind of planner full box. I kind of the open planner, piece of washi. And I put down my today sticker. I, this is the week that um, my oldest son got out of school. So it was actually a pretty busy week. I think that day right there was marking his end of the year party. And again, you have to excuse my son in the background. He is being extremely vocal. And yeah. So I put out that little paint nails of uh, foil text and that is from my shop. And this kit is from my shop, by the way. I'm I'm pretty sure you're able to see that at the beginning of the plan with me. Putting out that little piece of washi. Again, this kit was so pretty. Um the artwork is gorgeous. It's by the Cheeky Darling. And um it, when I first saw it, I knew I had to have it. It's not typically a color scheme I would go with, but it was really, really pretty and it was really popular. A lot of people came out with kits. I'm um, using this artwork during the time. So I was just putting down a little label right there, just kind of doing some finagling, put down a little uh, 
little strip, little little thing strip and covered it with a phone icon. I got a phone call to make that day. So moved on to Wednesday, put down my little to-do list. Put down, and that full box is, is so pretty with all the books, all the, not the books, the all the planner sacks. And my little today sticker. And then on Wednesday, my son had his moving up ceremony. So that's what that one um, three quarters box is for. And I did film, I think I must have at least filmed and edited that day. Um, most likely I filmed, edited, and uploaded. It was probably the previous week's plan with me. And I marked down some what would have been TV shows because this was, this is the last week for um, all like. The TV, all the finales came on this week, and then I was just putting the double box on the um, weekend there. And of course, I love a good double box. I put that really pretty planner girl on Thursday. I wanted her showcase on like the main two front pages of the spread, so because I feel like she's me. So, um, so anyway, on Friday, I put down new releases sticker again. Struggle busting with this plan with me. I was. Um, I feel like I was picked up so many stickers and put so many down. Um, but again, I edited so I edited this plan me down from probably like forty-five to fifty minutes down to like ten. By the time I cut out a bunch of just like extraneous footage and then sped it up. So yeah, and these um, next few plan with me's probably are going to be voiceovers just because like. I'm able to get through them quicker, and because the house is not typically quiet, just like it's not quiet now. Um, that was Thursday. I was putting down all of my TGIC. Again, all the finales came on that day. But so, yeah, so hopefully y'all don't mind it too much. I'll try my best to do some live ones. Typically, the daily ones are um, pretty much like non-voiceover ones. But I'm feeling like the weeklies are going to probably be voiceover um, going forward just because like with the summertime and all the kids being at home and things like that, it's just, it's already hard to film. And on top of that, like, yeah. it, it was, it would be ridiculous. So anyway, so I'm just putting down that full box with the little sticker kit and then a piece of washi. Now I'm flipping back over, doing a little to-do list for Saturday, which I never really have too much going on for Saturday. So typically I'm just kind of promoting, um, promoting and marketing new releases and say, you know, come out on Fridays. So I spent a large part of my Saturday doing that and designing. I kind of, I don't stop. I'm like, kind of like a, just a speeding locomotive. Once new releases come out, I'm just moving on to the next thing, whether it be, you know, uh, designing, you know, editing, just different things like that. So moving on to Sunday, my Sundays are typically pretty, pretty straightforward. There, um, I always take some time for faith and worship that day. And then I pretty much move into the rest of the day with shop things. So again, I never really stop on things. Now my camera cut out and I didn't realize it. So that was pretty much it for Sunday. So now you see me putting down the washi and I cut out a part of it where I was like cutting the washi in half only to realize that when I format this kit, it was in my newer format where I had already split the washi. So the floral washi was already split. So I just cut that all the way out because I'm like, that was, that was just me being like silly on that. Um, so I was just putting it out and I layered it with that uh, washi strip from the kit with the bows. And I think that's just super cute. I am in love with the bottom washi for this kit. And I was turning over. And doing the other side, not turning over, but I was on the, the second half of the week for this part. And just putting that washi down. I just need to snip it a little bit because the washi, the kit is formatted for the Erin Condren Life Planner. So, um, but you can easily struggle busting it again right there. But you can easily use it um, in your B6, A6, personal wide, personal whatever. You just, you know, you're just tweak it and cut down and however you need to. Um, I love using a full kit in my B6 rings because I am not in the Erin Condren right now. I do plan on getting one soon because I kind of want to, you know, I think I want to do it maybe um, journaling in it. So I think that's what I'll be using it for. And then I am going to be uh, getting the new deluxe monthly planner. Um, but my actually deluxe monthly planner doesn't run out for a while. So it may be a little bit later. Um, in the year, by the time I start doing plan with me's in it, my budget plan with me's and setups. But I know that there are people who are going to be starting theirs in July. So you can stay tuned for that. I will be purchasing one um, for shop purposes because I'll need the, the new measurements. I just saw some videos this morning. They just posted um, new videos this morning 
I guess the people who they sent out ones for PR purposes, they posted them this morning. So anyway, that is the completed spread. I hope you all like it. I'm a, you know, <laughs> super, super good. I forgot the weekend banner at this part, so that's what you see me doing. But anyway, so I will be purchasing the um, Deluxe Monthly Planner just for, again, sizing purposes and just to try it out. And I'll be um, probably reformatting my kits as well to fit that. But the July and August kit is already out, are already out. So what I may do is tweak it and uh, list an updated version. But the, the versions for the current um, dimensions and measurements are, you know, in the shop now. So I'm just running through the what I had left over for the kit. That is pretty much it for the plan with me. I really, really appreciate you all. Thank you so much for your support for watching. Give me a thumbs up if you like it. Please consider subscribing. Comment below and thank you again so much.